What's up, homies? It's me, Kiri Kai, Kiri Kiri Kim, back in another video. And today, here's my aunt. Say hi. Hi. How you doing? Now, the thing is, my mom said that right over there, she smelled a dead body odor, right? Die. I'm recording for animal or something. I'm recording something for YouTube. Oh. <laughs> I have my own YouTube account. Do you? Mm -hmm. Oh. That's why I said hi say hi. Okay. Now me and my aunt are gonna go check it out. We'll see what we can find. Oh yeah, I've also recently got a mask. <laughs> yeah. Tam cat. Right? Tammy cat. It's like a tabby cat, but Tammy. Uh What she, what your mom thought it was an animal, it might be a raccoon. Yeah, but she smelt it. Yeah, I know, but sometimes they're in there. And I wouldn't look in there because if, if it's a live raccoon, then yes. Yeah, so. Oh, there's a raccoon. It's definitely not coming from there. It's definitely not coming from in there, I can tell. But I think they smell something. You want to stand in front of the witch? Oh, I smell it. Just the dampness from inside, you know, when the rain gets inside. See, I don't, I'm not too good at selfies, are you? Huh? Are you good at selfies? Yeah? You take a selfie of the two of us? I can't borrow your phone so I don't have to stop recording mine. Sure. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. I'm gonna look this way if it's from in there or not. Because right. it could be the sun coming from in there all the way over here. No, I smell different now. Or a wild animal got in there and died. Well, sometimes the raccoons live in there, and who knows how old the raccoons are. And the witch I'm talking about. You know, I'm talking about some th that maybe an animal got into here. Oh, I think they could probably find their way out of there.
Well, I definitely smell the thing of death. What is it? Oh, it's just a piece of... Um, probably something that protected a wire at some point. Oh, probably that. Yeah, it might have been. Probably. Well, you're it's the only good, reasonable thing. You're a good detective. Yeah. Mini detective. Yeah, like over there. But not around this area. Yeah, I don't smell anything over here. It's just over there. We could possibly walk around. If you want. Yeah, if I smelt it over there, but my mom said it was over here. When this was less, when this was like the pony rides. Mm -hmm. Yep. All the animal feeding. Yeah, everything got moved around. The hay rides. Mm -hmm. Go check over there, see if the smell is coming from over there. Okay. And the wind is blowing over there when mom was taking her walk. That's a possibility. Well, it's, it's, it might be a possibility considering wind sometimes travels smell, right? Mm -hmm. Like when you bake a freshly baked pie. And then you smell it way across the house. Yeah. yeah. Hey, look, it's the air conditioning stack pile. Yeah, looks like an air conditioning cemetery, doesn't it? No, it's air conditioning Mount Edbit. Oh, okay. <laughs> I remember, like, when I got here before, when I was with um, Mom, Dad, Omi, mm -hmm. and the two dogs. Yep. And the trailer. Mm -hmm. I had my bike with me, so I would always ride my bike down this way. Turn around, go some other place, come back down here. Because it was like... It was like calm, mm -hmm. just calm and collected. Yeah, it, it is. It is very calm back here. Those weren't there before, though. So, my folks stuck around on the ball. Also, has looked things around for me.
Oh, now I found it. It wasn't death. Well, that's just no piece of bread. Yeah, that's just no piece of bread. Somebody's probably walking along and, and just threw it down. Okay. Now the bigger question is if mom smoked rotten flesh or rotten food. Maybe. Because it could have actually been an animal dead, rotten away, or just that piece of bread rotten. Just. Well, that, that's pretty close. True. They do make good detectives. Possibly. Yeah. But what could mom smell? I don't know. She said she smelled rotten flesh. <laughs> well, the flesh running away. Well, like I said, it might be a, something inside of the witch went in there to die. You know, it felt protected in there and it died. But this was only a couple of six minutes ago. Mm -hmm. If it went in there to die, it would have had to do that like a couple of months ago. Yeah. But the smell would still be there as it decays. Yeah. I'm gonna have to ask mom if it smelled like new, like old rotten flesh. Yeah. So or if, if somebody, if, if, if something just died, you would you would smell it. If you really wouldn't smell it. It would be like a couple of weeks and then it would yeah. decay. Right. It'd be like new rotten flesh. Yeah, right. So I'm gonna have to ask my mom whether whether she smelled old rotting flesh or new rotting flesh. You think she could tell the difference? Possibly. Because there's two different scents between the two. New rotting flesh smells like bleeding and blood and gore. Well, old rotting flesh smells like old dried up food. You know like an orange, how it rots up? Yeah. When it first rots, it smells like something. Uh -huh. And then when, it, like, all, when it's like at the end of the rotting thing, mm -hmm. it smells like something else. Yeah. Other than the first rot. <coughs> now the thing is, she smelled it near the witch. Mm -hmm. But from where I saw mom before, she was right at the front gate. By that I mean where we came in. This is indeed a mystery. And it's a mystery that I want to solve before I leave. Oh, and there's another mystery. Whose ball is that? Before. It was all the way over there, but yeah. then it was all the way over there, and yeah. now it's the wind, over there. The yeah, the wind blew it. Curiosity killed people. People at my school say curiosity killed the cat. Whenever, I'm, whatever, I'm getting curious about something, uh -huh. but I always say, "But satisfaction brought it back." Oh, okay. <laughs> So what I was, I'm always like the person that sees that if, you know, that if they see something mis mysterious, uh -huh. that they will literally, I will literally dig deeper into it. You want to investigate it. Yeah, and they were saying, curiosity kills Scott, and I'm like, with satisfaction, brought it back. So I'm always keep looking for evidence behind it. Uh -huh. So I'm going to say bye to the viewers. Well, this is the end of the videos, guys. Um, subscribe down below if you haven't already. Smash the like button in the face, like you believe in your unicorns, and I'll see you homies in the next video. Bye!